What's up you guys? It's Margo. I just filmed an entire haul and right when I ended it I was like that was probably one of the more boring videos that I've ever made. So I think part of the reason that it was really boring is because a lot of the stuff that I got is for an upcoming internship so it's very professional. Instead of refilming this entire thing I thought it would just be better to chop up the video that I had already filmed and just show you the things that I really love. There will be a lot of items cut out of the haul. I just think it's going to be better that way because it's just things that I actually love and I think that you're going to love. So with that being said, enjoy the haul and if you're confused about if things are missing or if I said that I said things when I didn't actually say them it's probably because I cut them out and yeah enjoy the haul and bye <laughs> so I'm actually gonna start out with clothes that were sent to me that I'm obsessed with if you guys have ever heard of Windsor store it's one of my favorite online stores and they actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted some clothes from there. Probably gonna have some of this stuff in a lookbook coming up, but I wanted to show you in case some of it didn't make it in. I got this gorgeous off-the-shoulder top, which I'm really a fan of off-the-shoulder tops. I think they're very flattering on all body types. You can tell it's a little bit cropped, but it fits the arms really well, and it's also really good quality. All this stuff is very, very good quality, and I don't have to worry about it being see-through. Then I got this bodysuit, which I'm in love with. It's this kind of like purpley pink um, low cut. It is very low cut, but it's really comfortable and it is a thong so you don't have to worry about like awkward lines if you're wearing a tight skirt or pants or whatever. I also got a black bodysuit and it's the ones that you've probably seen on like Instagram. I just wore that so it's in the wash. And for shorts, I have these shorts which I'm in love with and again they're lined so they're really easy to wear and the black I think will go really well with like vintage black t-shirts in the summer and then you have the green Ooh, it's gonna it's gonna be then I have these shorts and these are kind of similar to the Brandy Melville shorts because they do have the ruffles on the bottom but I like how they're tie-dye so they're perfect for PJs or over your bathing suit or just everyday wear I got this incredible bralette from them and honestly I can't even believe that it's from Windsor it looks like it's from like Love and Lemons this is not see-through. I don't know if it looks kind of see-through, but you don't have to wear anything under it. And it's beaded. I don't know if you can tell, but it's this stunning... If I was going to Coachella, I would wear this. Like, it is literally stunning. I do have a music festival coming up, so I might wear it to that. Next, they sent me these shoes, and I wore these to an event already and got so many compliments on them. Because they are really flattering on your feet. It's open in the front as well. And this just ties around your ankle. But again, very flattering and also really comfortable. I got two belts from them. This is one of them. And it's just kind of like a tribally hippie kind of like tie around belt. I'm looking forward to wearing this in the summer. Then I got this belt from them, which I'm sure you've seen similar ones from Urban Outfitters. This belt is very popular now and I'm in love with this. It does look like very legit. It has detailing on here, but I'm in love with this. Lastly, I got this necklace, which holy crap, this is gorgeous and it looks like one of those necklaces that are like hundreds of dollars online you don't need to spend that much money this was probably like around 15 to 20 yeah 15.90 for this and it's honestly stunning the detailing is very very nice i haven't worn it yet but i'm definitely looking forward to so that's all the stuff from windsor and i'll leave their link down below if you want to check it out this isn't sponsored i just love their stuff and i'm so grateful that they gifted me some stuff next i'm gonna show you some stuff that i got from marshall's some people are like ashamed to go there because they're like oh my god like it's weird but it's not if i ever need workout stuff i will go to marshall's because it's usually the same stuff that you can find like in lululemon it's a lot cheaper. Never seen Lululemon brand there, but like who cares about brands, honestly. So first I got these sick leggings and they have a mesh part on the side. Like you could buy these at yoga stores for like $90 and this was $20. And then I got these leggings, which actually these are inside out, but I guess you can wear it either way. It looks like it's reversible. Oh, it is reversible. So you can wear this darker way with the blue or the blue out and all of these are pretty long. And then I don't have these to show you but I also just got long black leggings, same material as Lululemon or Athleta, really good quality and they were like $17. When I was in California I did a bunch of vintage shopping because I love that. It's so good for the environment and there's just better clothes there. Like the stuff that I get from vintage shops I love 
so much more. So three pieces that I picked up with I'm obsessed with and these are really cool pieces. Um, if you ever go to Los Angeles or San Francisco, make sure you go thrifting there because the stuff there is incredible. So these I got from vintage stores, so that's technically like a more selective thrift shop. So I got this Ghostbusters shirt and it's like perfectly worn out. It's this charcoal color very comfortable and I like rolling the sleeves up. This graphic tee is so easy to throw on with jeans, leggings, black jeans, shorts, like anything. I love this shirt. Next thing I got was actually from this like outdoor market vintage shop that I'll show you a picture of and it, this was five dollars and it's a silk Ralph Lauren blouse and it's beautiful. It's kind of like Kind of reminds me of like Peter Pan style. I think it's gorgeous just wearing a little bralette under with like ripped denim shorts or pink shorts or something. I just think it's so pretty and it's going to be very good for the summer. Last thing I got from the California Vintage Shops. I'm sure you've seen this on my Instagram or even my YouTube. But I'm obsessed with these glasses. What's funny about them is they're not um, sunglasses. They're actually prescription. But they're my prescription. <laughs> So I just got really lucky that I got prescription glasses for $3 and they're bomb, as you can tell. First, I'll show you what I got at H&M. I'm sure you've seen shoes like this before, and I actually have similar ones, but the top is black rather than white. I've worn these like twice, and they're already really dirty, but that's what you get if you have white shoes. My feelings with shoes is you can't like cry if they get dirty. You just have to deal with it, but I love these. They're faux snake skin, and they are good quality. And these were $35, I think. Also, can we just appreciate that the H&M bag says it's World Recycle Week. They were giving 30% off for people who brought in their recycled clothes, which I think is awesome. Okay, next, moving on, I went to Saks Off Fifth, which is basically their outlet. First of all, I got this sweater, and if I take this off in the next, like, five years, you should be happy, because this is probably not going to come off of my body, even if you paid me a million dollars. I'm obsessed with it. It's Wild Fox. Oh my god, can we just... Mm. I love it. I also got these Vince Camuto shoes and these again are very professional but they're very attractive on your feet like they don't make your feet look ugly because I know that some pointy shoes do have like mesh on the side which is unique I've never seen that before but they're very comfortable to walk in for that reason because they're not like restricting. The last place I'm going to be showing you that I got clothes from is my favorite store on this planet. Zara! First is this dress that's kind of inspired by menswear, which I love. I think for the beach or whatever, it's so pretty. Or like if you unbutton it with a bralette, so pretty. This is more of a dress and you can wear like sandals or little booties with this. And uh, I love this. Then I got this like Barbie, Carrie Diary inspired skirt. Very thick, so it's definitely like good quality. I'm a fan. Similar to that, I got this skirt. Look at me buying colors. Uh, so proud of myself. Professional enough to go to meetings or meet people and it'll be perfect for the summer when it gets really hot. Then I got this adorable shirt. Again, it's kind of off the shoulder, but because I'm planning on wearing it for my internship, it does have these like thicker straps. And then this goes on your shoulder, but it's this pinstripe, very cute, and I will be wearing this all summer long. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I have to clean up this huge mess surrounding me now. I love you guys so, so much, and thank you so much for watching. Make sure you click the subscribe button, and I will see you next video.